What's going on YouTube? My name is Shifty and this is Shifty Gaming. Today, I'm going to be doing a quick, hopefully, I don't know how fast this is going to go guys. I might, I might, you know, dally on and talk about it forever. But um, I'm going to be doing a review of Bandicam. Now Bandicam has been my go-to uh, video, you know, recording game, recording software. Um, for years. I started using it back in like 2013, 2014, and it's only grown since then and gotten even better. So I want to do a quick little showcase to show you guys how uh, Bandicam works. So we're going to open it up, and it's going to tell me that I got to give it the rights to, to run. So if you go to the home, um, it's going to show you all these different things. This is you know, kind of your get started thing. If you want to, if you want to um, record or stop, you hit F12. If you want to take a screenshot, you hit F11. Um, so let's let's get into some of the options here. So um, this is the advanced section. Um, I never really fuck with this, but um, you can run Bandicam on startup if you want. Um, and you can start the full screen recording of Bandicam on startup, that sort of thing. Um, auto start recording, um, start full screen recording on Bandicam startup, that's totally up to you if you want to do something like that. Um, and you can set a timer for when it should start recording, like if you want to start recording something that happens at 3 o'clock, then you can set this to, to start recording then which is really cool. And um, auto-complete recording, um, well, this, this is nice because as somebody who's a Let's Player, I always have trouble with, um, you know, keeping, keeping time on my recordings. And I want to begin and end a video um, by a certain time and a lot of times if I don't have an auto end for my video, I will not know that, um, you know, I've gone on for a, a, a weird number of minutes. Maybe I want to make, a, a make, make 10 minute videos, but I record for 27 minutes. Does that mean I have to have two 10 minute episodes and one 7 minute episode? Because that doesn't seem fair. This way you can... Uh, uh, you can even you can you can record by the file size. So if you don't want to go over a certain file size, that's another option. And um, you can change the time here, um, and you can choose to start a new recording after that, um, stop recording and exit Bandicam, or shut down your computer. And um, I usually um, would do um, start a new recording that way. It just turn it ends the video at a certain time, so 10 minutes per se, and then it goes and immediately starts another episode. So I don't have to worry about starting and stopping over and over again. So um, let's go and continue down into some stuff that really matters, which is the video section. So um, first off, um, we're gonna look into the settings. Now this is a really cool feature of Bandicam which has me completely sold on it as my one of my main recording softwares for video games and that is that you can have two things recorded at once recorded on separate audio tracks that blew my mind and you know why because for years i had been recording video games with the with the sound turned all the way down so that it, you could hear me over the game, but with it, with this, if it's recorded on two separate files, so the the microphone's recorded on one track and your game sounds recorded on another track, then what you can do with that is drag it into Sony Vegas, and then you can um, edit the tracks individually, so you can turn down the game volume and you can turn up your voice volume and all that kind of stuff so that's that that's really good that's a really good thing and of course you can add um, a webcam overlay and I'm not gonna uh, mess with that because I don't usually use that feature if I want to have a webcam overlay I use uh, I use OBS 
so. Uh, but in this version of Bandicam, they have presets for your format. Um, and I choose Sony Vegas Premiere slash Pinnacle. Um, but you can choose from, you know, YouTube 720p, YouTube 1080p, ultra fast settings for 60 FPS, um, 60 FPS on all these different codecs, um, half size, you can change that, and then I have, um, you, uh, you can make your own, um, user preset, which is really cool, um, so just say you want to, you want to do the Sony Vegas, uh, one, but you also want to go into the settings and maybe you want to record at half size and 100% quality and 60 FPS or something like that. I don't know. Um, you can do that though. You can completely 100% um, do that and you can customize the audio and you can customize so many things um, on this and it's just so great because there's so many different builds. There's builds for, for you know, a beefy computer that needs 1080p, you know, recording. Um, there's ones for low-end PCs. There's ones that are, um, that record in HD but have a, f a smaller uh, file size. You know, all, all sorts of stuff and all, all different ways that you can record your, uh, your, 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 your video. And that's just really important. For uh, for someone like me who uh, needs to have his his uh, his recording done in a uh, very specific way, so um, this this I, and also this, there's this right here, which uh, allows you to record HDMI sources. I don't know what this is capable of. I haven't looked into it, but I think that if you could get a splitter for your um, for your uh, computer and your maybe Xbox or PS4, then you could potentially record uh, video game footage with this, um, with the HDMI section. Um, so uh, I, I'm not even going to look into that right now, but uh, I highly recommend looking into that if you want to buy this. Um, now I will tell you one thing right now that um, buying this software is essentially optional. Um, the, the old Bandicam watermark that used to be up at the top um, isn't there anymore and it's replaced with a newer, more sleek, hard to notice one that doesn't take away from the video itself. Um, and it records for up to 10 minutes and then it stops recording and tells you that you need to buy the, the program to record uh, more than 10 minutes. But hey, I record 10 minute videos anyway, so what's the big deal? Um, and I am, <laughs> I, that's, 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 just, that's just me though. Um, and everything else is completely available to you. Um, I have never, I, I've been on the, the, the trial before and I'm, I now have the full version, and um, I don't think there's a single thing that uh, um, that is taken away from you, a single feature, if you're just using the trial. So um, that's my review of Bandicam. I would give it honestly 9 out of 10. It's a very good program. It's the best screen recorder and screenshot taking software that I know of so that's my that's my opinion on it and I hope that this helped, helped you guys out and maybe um, informed a purchase for you guys or a download to try it out so um, I'll talk to you guys later bye bye